Bill, I've heard so much of you saying let go of your children like when they're adults. I have a son who's 29. <laughs> and, good, and good luck if you don't. Right? <laughs> oh, it's tough. Be- well, I mean, I'm trying not to, like I'm not a helicopter mother or anything like that, but I have trouble having even conversations with him because I really feel like he does not like us. He, um, since the day he well, was minute, born, I asked minute. God. Hold on, hold on, hold on a second. Okay. <laughs> you started with not being able to let go, but now you're talking about you can't have conversations. So that sounds like there has been a letting go somewhere. Well, yeah. I mean, he lives in, in Texas. We're in Nevada. So I can't, okay. you know, like right. over mother him. I don't call him every day or anything like that. But it seems like well, that's um, not a, when we. That's not a high bar. <laughs> oh, I'm not a helicopter parent. I don't call it every day, right? So what, what, give me the question. Give me the question. You feel like he doesn't like you, but give me the question. How? I don't know how to just break it down to one thing. How do I... Hmm. I guess, how do I stop? So here's what I told Albie. Like, let's just say I'm in Texas visiting him and he drives like a maniac. And I say, Colt, could you slide down, slow down? And he just gets bent. Or will you put on your seatbelt, please? And he just. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Okay. Why? Why do you think a 29, now I want you to imagine, why would a 29-year-old kind of get upset about his mother telling him how to drive? Well, if he drew, drove normal. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Jane, Jane, look, stop, just stop for a second. If I'm 29 and my mother is telling me how to drive, I don't get bent. I say either, oh, gosh, mom, good idea. I should be wearing a seatbelt. You're right. I shouldn't be going 80 and a 30 mile. Thanks, mom. And then I keep driving. There you I go. Don't get bent. All right. Or, uh-huh. or, mom, thanks for your advice, but I don't, I don't really do that. So here's a, you said you wanted some lunch. What's coming up here? Now, the point I'm making here is whether or not he's wise or foolish. The question is, if he's getting bent, then he's still fighting off being a kid. He still wants, he's trying to have it push mother away from him. He can't laugh at mom. Mom, you're, <laughs> mom, you're not a mom anymore. I can drive. He can't laugh at it. He's pushing. So the fact that he has a reaction tells me he does not feel in control of himself. He feels like you and others potentially are in control of him. And he's still fighting that battle. And so probably a lot of the what you're calling not liking us is the pushing away of a teenager delayed to 29. So what do, like I, for a while, uh, I've been around alcoholism and I'm an Al-Anon and all that stuff. So I've tried to like, let him be who he is, but like the driving thing really, truly is an example. Cause then he almost goes faster just to irritate me or whatever. Of course he does. You, you know? guys are in a, you guys are in a dance where you're, you're saying, I'm going to manage you. No, you're not. Yes, I am. No, you're not. Watch this. Uh, Let's run up on the curb. I'll show you, Mom. Of course you are. You're in a tug of war. How do you get out of a tug of war? How do you win yeah. a tug of war? How do you win a tug of war? How do you get out of one? You let go of the rope. Let go? Let go of the rope. How do you let go, though? Just, like, me keep my mouth shut? Like what? Do I just keep my mouth shut and not say, don't go 80 in a 35 or whatever? Did it Did it help? No. Has it ever helped? <laughs> no. 
No. Has it has it ever helped? No, I no. He pushes back. Oh, yeah. so he, he pushes. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. He doesn't take your advice. No. Huh. And here's okay, the other so thing. what do I what do I do? Hold on. No, no, no I don't need another thing. Okay. <laughs> what? Let me see. What am I going to do today? I'm going to get up. And what kind of day am I going to have? I'm going to find somebody that doesn't take my advice and hasn't for 29 years. And I'm going to call him and I'm going to give him advice. That sounds like a great day to me. That's oh a God. great. I can't you wait so to simple. get up. How can? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. I wish I had more time. Um, me too, because you make it so simple. But, Okay, listen, I'm going to try. L- listen, listen, what are you going to try? Go to Al-Anon and say, I, hi, I'm Jane, and I'm a controlling mother, and I need to learn <laughs> how to let go of my kid. And they're going to go, hi, Jane, we understand, and then they're going to help you. But let me let me give you an example. Okay? Okay. Ready? Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm you. All right? You're your son. We're in the car. Okay. Uh-huh. First of all, first of all, the new you won't get in the car with your son because he doesn't know how to drive. Okay. The new you would say, you know what? I'll meet you at dinner because you like to go fast. I don't. I'm going to Uber. Okay. But let's just assume I had a bad day and I got in the car with you. Okay. Uh-huh. All right. Ready? Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Joey, could you? Kind of like slow down a little bit. I'm getting nervous over here. Well, honestly and truly, he scares me. No, 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 no. You be Joey. I'm you. Oh, me be Joey. I just said. I just said that. Oh. I said Joey. <laughs> Joey, I'm getting scared over here. I'm scared, Joey. Can you slow down? I know how to Let's drive, see. Mom. I know how to drive, Joey. Oh, okay. So I'm judging from that. You don't want to slow down. Would you do this? Would you pull over? Because I'm afraid and I'd like to get out. And I'll call an Uber and I'll meet you at the restaurant. I did that one time and he, no kidding, drove faster. And Joey, would not if pull you over. Don't, if you don't slow down right now, I'm getting on my, I ask you to pull over. If you don't slow down right now, I'm getting on my phone. I'm calling the police and telling them that I've been kidnapped. Oh, you're just being so dramatic. You're just being dramatic. I'm going to count to three. And you're either you pull over, or I'm going to I'm going to show you what drama looks like. One. Okay. Two. Three. Nine one one. Hi, this is Jane. I haven't called into the Doctor Cloud show to find out that I shouldn't even get in the car in the first place, and I am in the car, and my my kid is endangering my life. Here's my address. He is going, this is a license plate. This is a car. Please send help. I'll stay on the line, officer. You would go that now, far if it went that far, huh? If my life oh is my goodness, I'm not going to let, I, look, when I was, when my daughter was learning how to drive and we had the permit thing and I'm over in the other seat and she didn't do the stop right or so it didn't stop. I said, Olivia, you don't, you know, slow down or this and that. And she said to me, she said, she said, dad, I, I know what I'm doing. I know how to drive. I said, Olivia, pull over. She pulled over. I said, Olivia, this is when you know how to drive. When I can sit here and I'm not scared. Right now I'm scared. So you, I want you to fix that. I want you to make me feel comfortable. Until then, you're not driving on your own, period. Okay. Now, here's what I want you to notice. And I got to go, Jane, unfortunately. Okay. Boy, we could unpack. You call me back, okay? I, I, want, to I to want to call you back because I have other questions. <laughs> yeah, I bet you do. So <laughs> here's the deal. If you notice, when I'm in the car with Joey, I'm not trying to nag him or get him to do anything. I made a request to which he said no. And he's a 29 year old. He can go fast or he can do whatever he wants to, but I don't have to participate because I'm the only one I have control of. So if Joey doesn't want to drive normally, then I'm saying, okay, well, that's fine. I'm getting an Uber. 
I'm in control of me, not Joey. Yeah. You've been trying to control Joey, and he's controlling you. Okay. And look how rocky this boat is when we're trying oh, yeah. to do that. Yeah. Okay. Jane, yeah. got to run. 